What's going on, movie guards? If you're new to the channel, my name is Christian and welcome to Sea Roll Productions. We got some brand new official new looks at the new mutants and it doesn't disappoint. I have been excited for this movie since the idea, since the first trailer, like five years ago. <laughs> Look, that's such a long time ago. It wasn't five years. I'm being, you know, I'm being dramatic. But it just, I feel like this film has been, you know, in the works for so long and with the whole complication over there at Fox and, you know, Kinsberg trying to take control and just, it, it's a shame. It really is a shame that, you know, Josh Boone didn't really get to see his film in full potential when it was actually supposed to drop. And it was supposed to come out this year. It was supposed to come out, I believe, in April. Got delayed. All of Disney's films got delayed. And all of Disney's films got, you know, new release dates, except for New Mutants. Nobody knows what's happening with this particular film. Nobody knows. And it's very frustrating. Because as a fan of, you know, X-Men and Marvel, I want to know what's happening with this particular movie. I am hyped. I want to see this movie. I really enjoyed the first two trailers. I like what I see. And within these stills, the demon bear looking fucking terrifying. This, this other freaking creature looks scary. Like, I am hyped for this movie. It looked like, you know... Fox took a gamble on something new and refreshing, and I love the idea by that. They're not playing it safe. I mean, the New Mutants are, you know, pretty damn unique as a group of characters in the X-Men world, especially like Magic being Colossus' sister. Even if this is even if this is going to tie into like a Deadpool universe, who knows? But this this film could most likely be Fox's last X-Men movie underneath that belt. But if this film does significantly well and Kevin Feige likes this movie and he likes Josh Boone and what he, what his take on the new mutants, they could potentially even make this, you know, canon into the MCU, which would be fine with me. Because like I said, I really enjoy what I've seen so far, especially from these stills. I'm like, damn, can we get another trailer or something? Like, what's going on with this release date? Or do, do they plan to intend to just drop this on VOD? And if so, when? So I can, you know, rest that day off and rent this movie. Because I really want to see the new mutants. Like I said, it looks fucking dope. Um, even if they decide to give it a release date. Whoa, where, when are they going to release it? You already gave a bunch of new Disney films that were coming out. Marvel films that were coming out. New release dates. Other studios push, you know, their films back as well. Taking release dates. What's the goal? What's the plan for this movie? Now, I doubt this movie will make hundreds and hundreds and hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of millions of dollars. It's most likely not going to. And I feel that's why Disney doesn't want to release it. He's like, oh, man, do we really want to promote and market this movie and spend money on this movie and money we won't make back? That's where I feel Disney is like, mm, maybe not. Maybe not. And Disney's in a rut right now with the whole Disney World being closed. And, you know, it, it, they're not doing well financially, even though they're a multi-billion dollar company. They're, they're losing out on a lot, a lot of money right now. A lot of money. Think about all the money generated from Disneyland in a single day. Disneyland's been closed for about a fucking month now. You know what I'm saying? And they're still paying out salaries and stuff like that. And, you know, CEOs are taking pay cuts and that's great for them. But they're losing out on money. So a film like New Mutants is on the very bottom of their list. It's not top priority. It's not. And that's really unfortunate because, you know fucking fox uh, it's, it's, it really sucks but i still want to see this movie i really do i like what i've seen these fucking brand new stills look scary they look terrifying that demon bear looks scary magic looks dope like i am so hyped for this movie like it feels like it's going to be like a breakfast club kind of tied into like a disturbing behavior faculty type movie you know uh, I'm, but I'm, I'm pumped man i'm pumped and i hope to get more new details on this film in the near future. And once I do, I will give you guys the new details on what they're doing for the new mutants. Because, like I said, this might be the last property that, you know, Fox drops for, you know, for their X-Men. You know what I mean? But it's underneath, the, of course, the Disney belt. But it's going to be interesting to see what happens. But post your comments down below. Let me know what you guys think about the new mutants and these stills. What are your thoughts? What are your opinions? And do you think this film will ever get a release date? Or do you think it's going to be dropped on VOD? Post your comments down below, you guys. And thank you for taking time of your day. Fortune Zero Productions. Peace. We out. We out. We out.